Our final document this week is Report 9066, A Bibliography. Now the entries in a bibliography are arranged alphabetically by the author's last name and all entries are typed with a hanging indent. That is the most important feature of this assignment since the references are all accurately ordered and formatted for you on page 367. You are merely copying the information but you need to know how to use a hanging indent and you should check your word manual page 97 for a review of how to do that. This basically means that each entry begins at the left margin. The carryover lines are automatically indented a half inch by the hanging indent. It's automatic. You do not press enter at that point. You're going to single space each entry in the bibliography and press enter two times between each entry. Okay, let's begin work. I'm going to put my copy of what you will see on page 367 over here on the right so that I can demonstrate the hanging indent for you. Now the same as with the table of contents, we're going to press enter five times, center, turn on caps lock, and type bibliography. There is no need to make it bold or change the font size because we're going to apply a style afterwards. Press enter two times and go back to left alignment and now before we begin this part we're going to change our paragraph alignment. In the dialog box here under indention we're going to go over to special and choose hanging. Click OK. Turn off caps lock and type the first reference name Here begins a URL and we do not want it to hyperlink. It begins with carrots it ends with a carrot. Be careful not to let it automatically turn into a hyperlink which it just did. So I'm going to press undo and then go on typing. After the period I press enter two times and begin the next reference or source note. Here we have an italicized book title. Okay, once the references are complete, you can go back to Bibliography, apply the title style. Now I want to show you one more thing before we stop here. If your hyperlink was automatically converted, this is what you need to do if you don't catch it right away. Select the hyperlink, right click, remove hyperlink, then reinsert your carrots and you're all set. Okay, if you save, submit this to GDP for scoring and correct all keystroking errors, you will have completed a very big project with a long report and three supplementary pages. You've done a great job and I'll see you next week.